Yo, what is going on everybody? So hey, it's Free Gamer. Hope you're a fantastic day. Welcome back to another Madden video. In this video, I'm going to give you guys another really good coin making method. Now, this coin making method is another low risk, high reward coin making method. So once again, do this method at your own risk because you guys can lose coins from this method. But worst case scenario, you guys will only lose about 10,000 coins. That's pretty much absolute worst case scenario. Best case scenario, you guys will gain. There's not Actually, there's not really a limit to how many coins you guys can gain. So best case scenario, if you guys get really lucky, you guys can get 100,000, 200,000 plus coins depending on how lucky you guys get. So I do highly recommend you guys at least try this method. Although you guys will need a decent amount of coins, I recommend you guys do this method with probably around 120,000 coins because I recommend you guys buy 297 overalls in order to this method. We'll go through all that later in this video, but just try out this method and see if you guys get lucky because worst case scenario, you guys will only lose about 10,000 coins. But please do subscribe and press the bell so that way you guys get notified whenever I upload because I do upload a coin making method video every single day. Also, please do like and comment because it does help me get discovered more on YouTube. Also, I am currently giving away this 99 overall Walter Payton, so right now there's no way to enter. So how this giveaway is gonna work is once I reach 1750 subs, I will be putting him on the trade block for four days, and then once three days have gone by, I will be accepting a random trade offer. So pretty much right now there's no way to enter the giveaway, but once I reach 1750 subscribers, I will give you guys more info on how to enter the giveaway. But I just wanted to let you guys know I am currently running giveaway. So here are his stats. He's probably the best running back besides the golden tickets, obviously. So 96 speed, 97 acceleration. Great stats. I'm thinking about getting him for my team just because I love those stats. I might be getting golden ticket Bo Jackson, but if I cannot afford Bo Jackson, then I might be getting this Walter Payton. He do also does come with human joystick if you guys power him up so he's definitely one of the best running backs in the game and a shout out to Michelle Gia Martino for being part of the Noti Gang. I think that's how you say that. Sorry if I pronounced it wrong. But if you guys want a chance to be shouted out, all you guys have to do is subscribe and press the bell. So that way you guys get notified whenever I upload and comment Noti Gang within the first two minutes of a new upload. And you guys also have to like that video. And I'll pick somebody random to shout out that does all of that. So shout out to Michelle Gia Martino for being part of the Noti Gang. So the method we'll be talking about will be this 85 plus overall theme builder player pack. So inside of this pack, you guys can get an 85, an 87, a 90, a 93, a 95, and a 97 overall. So I'm going to show you guys what to do with each overall. It's actually not that complicated whatsoever. So the reason why this method isn't that complicated is because I only recommend you guys do one thing with one overall and that's the 87 overall. So I recommend you guys sell everybody else but with your 87 overalls I recommend you guys put them into this set right here. So you guys need three 87 overalls in order to complete this set. And the reason why I recommend you guys do that is because it's very low risk. Worst case scenario, you guys will only lose a thousand coins from doing this. Best case scenario, you guys can gain twenty to thirty thousand coins. Like some players in the set can give you guys twenty, thirty thousand coins. You're hoping for ultimate legend set piece cards because, like Lawrence Taylor, Michael Vick, some of those ultimate legend set piece cards can go for like twenty to thirty thousand coins. So yeah, I recommend you guys put your eighty-seven overalls in there and just test your luck. Because worst case scenario, you guys will only lose a thousand coins. Coins. Best case scenario, you guys can gain upwards of 20 to 30,000 coins. So that's the only thing I recommend you guys do. Everything else is optional. Like, I'm going to give you guys some optional things you guys can do with your 85 overalls. So another thing you guys can do with the players you guys pull from that pack is putting them into this Rookie Premier Exchange set to get some Rookie Premier tokens. If you guys still need to complete some Rookie Premier sets, that's how I completed this 85 to 89 overall leader player exchange set. I just put all my 85 overalls into that set right here. So you guys can put your 85 overalls in here and your 90 overalls in here and get some pretty cheap Rookie Premier tokens. You guys won't be making as much profit if you guys put them into these sets obviously, but you guys will be able to get the Rookie Premier tokens for pretty cheap. So that's another thing you guys can do with the players you guys pull. So with your 90 overalls, there really isn't a profitable set to put the 90 overalls in. Maybe the 91 to 92 overall elite player exchange set, but I don't recommend you guys do that. I recommend you guys just sell your 90 overalls up on the auction house or put them into the rookie premiere sets. So that's the only thing I recommend you guys do with your 90 overalls. So now let's talk about 93 overalls. So remember, these sets aren't the sets I recommend you guys do because they add more risk to this method. I just recommend you guys put them up on the auction house and just sell them. But if you guys are feeling risky, then you guys can do some of the sets I showed you. But I recommend you guys just sell them on the auction house. These sets are just for the people who feel risky. So with your 93 overalls, if you guys are feeling risky, you guys can put them into this set right here. Worst case scenario, you guys will lose about 15,000 coins. Best case scenario, you guys will gain about 40 to 50 
50,000 coins if you guys get lucky. So that's a thing you guys can do with your 93 overalls. Another thing you guys can do with your 93 overalls is putting them into this 95 to 96 exchange set. So once again, worst case scenario, you guys can lose about 15 to 20,000 coins. Best case scenario, you guys can gain upwards of 100 to 200,000 coins if you guys get lucky. So some optional stuff you guys can do. But once again, I just recommend you guys sell them up on Auction House. So now let's talk about your 95 and your 97 overall. So there isn't really a set for them to go into that are profitable. So I don't recommend you guys put them into any sets. I recommend you guys just sell your 95 and your 97 overall on the auction house. So that's those are all the optional things you guys can do with every player. Remember, I just recommend you guys just sell every player besides your 87 overalls. But if you guys are feeling a little bit risky, you guys can do some of the sets I told, told you guys. But the only thing I recommend you guys do is put your 87 overalls into the 89 to 90 overall lead exchange set and sell everybody else. So now we're going to actually do this method. So we're going to buy some 97 overalls. Alright, so you guys usually want to buy these for around 60,000 coins. So 61,000 coins, that's definitely not bad at all. And usually I like to buy two or three of these when I do this method. So we're just going to buy two of them for this video. And that's why I said I recommend you guys do this with 120,000 coins because each one of these 97 overalls costs around 60,000 coins. So you guys will need about 120,000 coins to buy two of them. So we're just going to sit here and wait for another 60,000 coin one to pop up. So we're just going to wait here a few minutes and I'll be right back. So there we go. We were able to get Quentin Nelson for about 60,000 coins. So these cards pop up really fast so you guys don't usually have to wait that long to find one that goes for 60,000 coins. All I like to do to wait is go program theme builder 2 quality 96 97 and just go back and forth between all offense and all defense and just wait for 60,000 coin one to pop up. All I had to do was wait for a few minutes and there was one that popped up so be patient don't overpay for these 97 overalls and yeah you guys should be able to make some easy profit. I find it funny that Darren Waller used to go for like a lot of coins and now he's training value like people buy Darren Waller to quick sell him which is kind of funny and sad at the same time so now we're gonna open about 40 of these packs and I won't let you, I won't make you guys sit through it so I'll just see you guys at the end once I've opened all, all these packs so I'll be right back also just another quick tip if you guys want to get through these packs faster than what you guys can do is you guys once you guys open these packs you guys want to wait for the beginning animation to end so once you guys wait for this end so right now you guys want to spam the back button so for ps4 it's circle and for xbox it's b so once again you guys want to wait for this blue yellow you know all this pack animation to end and then once your card actually shows up you guys want to spam circle or b on xbox and you guys should be able to get through these packs a lot faster and there we go, we opened about 40 of those packs and we did get lucky and pull a 97 overall. So that right there pretty much solidifies that we're gonna be making profit. So besides that, we didn't really get too lucky. Um, we pulled 190 overall, so that's about it. So that's kind of disappointing. We only pulled 290 plus overalls out of 40 packs, but still we pulled a decent amount of 87 overalls. And with the 87 overalls, you guys can still make a lot of profit. So like I said, with the 87 overalls, you guys want to put them into the 89 to 90 overall elite exchange set. So I'm gonna put all my 87 overalls in there and then we're gonna go on a pack opening all right so we were able to afford about five of these packs hopefully we get lucky with one of these packs so the animation we're looking for is an ultimate legend set piece so we got a theme builder 90 dallas goddard i'm pretty sure that's about break even so we got four of these packs left so hopefully we can um, get an ultimate legend set piece ultimate legend 89 rob gronkowski he might actually be going for a decent amount so now we got three of these packs left so come on, Ultimate Legend, Big X, we got 89 Larry Allen, that actually might be going for a decent amount too. We got two of these packs left. Heavyweight, that's usually not good. 90 Marcus Gilbert, so one more of these packs left. So this actually was not a bad pack opening whatsoever. Another Big X, we get 90 Reggie White. All right, so let's see how much profit we made in total. So now we're gonna add up everything. So before we add up everything, I just want to see what the average 85 overall theme builder player is selling for. So we're going to go to program theme builder 2. So let's see what the average 85 overall is selling for. So besides this 2200 coin card right here, it looks like they're selling for about 3000 coins. So we'll just say on average, they sell for about 2500 coins. So we'll just say each 85 overall we have is about 2500 coins. So it just makes it easier to add up. So that way I don't have to look at each one of them and see how much they go for on the auction house. So now let's see how much profit we made in total. So let's add up the 589 to 90 overalls we got. Holy crap, Reggie White goes for 20,000 coins. That is definitely a big fat W right there. So 20,000 coins for Reggie White. 
And this is why I recommend you guys do that pack, because that pack can give you guys a ton of coins. So that's about 11,000 coins, so that's about 31,000 coins. And this is, this is all including tax, by the way. So another 15,000 coins, holy freaking crap, 46,000 coins, let's go. And then Gronkowski, how much does Gronk go for? Alright, so this one was the worst one, so that's about 10,000 coins, so we'll say that's about 56,000 coins. And then finally, Dallas Goddard goes for about, we'll just say, we'll just say he goes for 10,000 coins. I doubt he's selling for that much. So that's about 66,000 coins. Alright, so now let's add up the rest of our players. Hold on, before we count our 85 overalls, we're going to see how much this 97 Darius Leonard goes for. So I doubt he's selling for that much. We'll just say he's going for about training value. We'll just say he's selling for about 60,000 coins. So 60,000 plus 66,000 is about 126,000 coins. So that alone, just our 97 of all, and these five players we pulled from the 89 to 90 makes our coins back because we only spent 120,000 coins and we've already made back 126,000 coins, not including the 85 overall. So we're about to make a lot of profit. So now we got to add up all the 85 overalls. So about that's about 10,000 coins right there. So each four 85 overalls equals about 10,000 coins. That's about 10,000 coins about 20,000 coins, uh, that's about 22, 25, 27, 30,000 coins, 32, 35, 37, 40,000 coins, 42, 45, 47, 50,000 coins, 52.5 thousand coins. All right, so now we're at about, hold on. So that adds up to about 178,000 coins. I just want to see what an 87 overall is selling for right now. So 87 overalls are selling for about 3,500 coins, including tax. Let's see how much these 90 overalls are selling for. So these 90 overalls are selling for about 9,000 coins. So, all right. Now we're going to add up our 87 and our 90 overalls. So I'm pretty sure we have two 87 overalls because you guys obviously can't put two 87 overalls into the 89 to 90. So I have two 87 overalls that I could have put it, could not put in there. So we'll just add 7,000 to our total. So now we just have to count our 190 overall. So let's see, where is the area? So Vince Beagle goes for about 18,000 coins. Once again, I doubt he's selling for that much. So we'll just say he goes for about 9,000 coins, which is quick sell value. So that adds up to about 194,000 coins. So we spent about 120,000 coins and we got back about 194,000 coins. So we made about a 70,000 coin profit. So obviously I did get lucky and pulled the 97 overall. So yeah, that was a pretty good pack opening. And that, like I said, it is a low risk high reward coin make method. So you guys could lose coins, but usually probably 89% of the time I make coins. So I do recommend you guys try out this method and I hope this video has helped you. If it did, please do subscribe, like, comment, and put notifications on if you're new because I do upload a coin making method video every single day. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I'm the Hatch Gamer. Remember to love God with all your heart, mind, and soul strength and to love your neighbors as yourself. God bless. Wash your hands. Stay home. Stay safe. Peace.